Hey, good day. <clears throat> we are, uh, I'm taking this video so people get an idea of what certain amount of rainfall might look like. Uh, so you would know what type of rain insurance or how much rainfall you should insure for. So today is May the 8th. 2023 I'm on the northwest side of the city it just started raining a few minutes ago uh, maybe 10 minutes ago it is 10 30 in the afternoon on May 8th I will be contacting the National Weather Service to find out how much rainfall happened between the hours of 10 and 11 o'clock for a specific area in the city, which is, uh, let's just say Montrose and Milwaukee. That is Milwaukee Avenue and 4400 North in the city of Chicago. So they'll be able to pinpoint exactly how much rain fell in this section of the city uh, at these hours. Now, you got to think, Would I would think this much rain, that would certainly mess with my event. Now, the grand total of rainfall for this hour might not be very much. It might only be, you know, one-tenth of an inch of rain, or it might be six one-hundredths of an inch of rain. But this amount of rain would definitely mess with an outdoor event if it was, you know, let's say an outdoor festival like the Blue Society puts on an outdoor festival. So it would definitely mess with your attendance, um, you know, the amount of uh, people that would attend. So we'll just kind of, well... Look at that guy's license plate number. I shouldn't be focusing on that. Sorry about that guy. But there's already puddles. And... So rain insurance is a good thing to buy. It doesn't have to cancel out your event totally in order to pay out a claim but I, I would definitely think if I'm holding an outdoor festival that maybe the maybe the festival cost twenty five thousand dollars you know you got to pay your musicians you have to pay the sound people you've got to you know pay your staff there's a lot of money that's involved and then you've got all the merchandise that you buy that doesn't sell because it's raining or doesn't sell as much and going into a, a venture like that you certainly plan on making money but if it rains like this and people don't show up you still have to pay your musicians you still have to pay the sound guy you still have to pay the uh, the staff so with rain, people aren't going to come out. So rain insurance, it's a totally worthwhile investment. Let's say you suggest, oh, if it, I want to insure, you know, between a five hour period, let's say from two in the afternoon to seven at night, that if it rains a grand total of, let's say, a a quarter inch of rain and you and your your policies for you know five or twenty five thousand and it rains you, it'll pay off so knowing what a certain amount of rain looks like is really important
So it might only rain six one hundredths of an inch during this hour, but if it's a few hours and it adds up, that's that's your insurance policy. So in the comments below, after after today is over, I'm gonna make a request to see how much rain actually fell during this period of time at this address, in this area of the city. And then you'll see how much rainfall fell during this hour. And then you can visually see, you know, what it actually looks like. And I'm telling you, whatever the total is here, this would certainly, you know, people would certainly wanna maybe not come out to your event if it's raining like this. I'm trying to find a puddle. Give you an idea of what it might look like in a puddle. That's a significant amount of rain. Well, there's some geese. There's your rain. All right, guys and gals. Um, good luck with whatever event you're doing, and uh, certainly encourage you to buy rain insurance. I use uh, Vortex Rain Insurance. Vortex, or they've been very kind to me. Worked with me, uh, you know, through all of my questions. And my agent is Andrew. He's been more than patient and willing to work with me and help me figure out, you know, how rain insurance works. And uh, I saw a video like this online one day and I said, well, when I get the chance, I'm going to take another video so people can see what the actual rain amounts look like. Because I had no clue. You figure, oh, one inch of rain, that's, you know, that, this, this probably won't even equal one inch of rain. So, you know, it's good if you have an idea of what a certain amount of rain looks like, and that's the whole purpose behind this video, and hopefully that'll help uh, with your rain insurance policy, which I certainly recommend getting for any kind of event, whether it's a barbecue event, uh, outdoor wedding. Jeez, could you imagine an outdoor wedding in rain? So get you some insurance. All right, guys, have a wonderful, fantastic great day and uh, I'll leave this rolling a little bit longer until I get to my next spot that I have to go and see some people which I'm coming up to exactly what I wanted to do. I wanted to find a nice puddle and just kind of end the video on this puddle so you guys can again let's turn that down a bit
Maybe that's not the best puddle. There, that looks a little better. I think the black background makes it stand out a little better. Okay, it's 1040. Have a great day.